published 2031 EDT, the 27th of October 2017 updated 2041 EDT, the 27th of October 2017 Iris Law is courting a handsome fellow Burberry model, Kelvin Bueno Both pictured Jude Law and Sadie Frost were mainstays of the Primrose Hill set of actors, models and Ians that became a byword for 90s hedonism with their drink and drugs parties, bed hopping and alleged wife swapping. Now, their daughter, Iris Law, is making her own mark on the capital social scene. I can reveal the 17-year-old is courting a handsome fellow Burberry model, who grew up on the mean streets of Brazil. While Iris, the goddaughter of hard-living supermodel Kate Moss, was raised in a multi-million pound villa in one of London's most desirable neighborhoods, her 19-year-old boyfriend, Kelvin Bueno, lived in a tower block in the densely populated Santos district of Sao Paulo. Bueno, which means good in Portuguese, is also a graffiti artist in Ian, and he composed a, called, 22 Reasons, to celebrate Iris' birthday this week, it's the way, you walk and talk, I think I found my love, he sings, it's the way you call my name, there I sent another way to say I found my love today, and I ain't letting go, the couple pictured have been courting for several months after meeting through friends. Bueno, who sports long braids and two gold teeth, is studying at Goldsmiths, University of London, and has set up his own artist community, Saz. Iris first hit the headlines when she was just two years old after she bit into an ecstasy pill she found on the floor at a children's party at Soho House. Her actress and model mother divorced the talented Mr. Ripley star Jude in 2003, allegedly following a wife-swapping episode with designer Pearl Lowe and her husband, drummer Danny Goffey. Happily, Iris' romance with Kelvin has already won the approval of Sadie's bohemian mother, Mary, who described them on social media as a gorgeous couple. Douglas struggles to flog flashy mansions. Property prices are said to be falling in some parts of Britain, but I doubt any seller has been forced to make the sort of cut Hollywood star Michael Douglas has on his Spanish villa. After struggling to find a buyer for his spectacular clifftop Mallorca mansion, the Oscar winner, who is married to actress Catherine Zeta-Jones, has had to knock £17 million off the asking price. Catherine Zeta-Jones and her husband Michael Douglas during a trip to St. Tropez Douglas, 73, who bought the luxury pad in 1989 with his former wife Deandra Luca, has spent millions renovating the 11-bedroom property and calls it his spiritual home. After their divorce, the couple co-owned the villa on a timeshare basis. But the 250-acre wine estate is now on sale for £32 million, down from £49 million when it first went on the market two years ago. Douglas and Zeta Hones, 48, are also struggling to sell their home in Bermuda Pictured, which has been on the market for £8 million since last September to add insult to injury. Douglas and Zeta Hones, 48, are also struggling to sell their home in Bermuda, which has been on the market for £8 million since last September. The couple left should NT be too troubled, however, they are said to have a joint fortune of £190 million. In 2003, Swansea-born Catherine remarked a million dollars isnt a lot of money for people like us, Wendy plays dress up with toy boy Wendy Deng, 48, and her 22-year-old boyfriend Bertold Zahorin at a Halloween party in New York since Wendy Deng lunged at a custard pea-throwing protester who attacked her then-husband, media magnate Rupert Murdoch, she has had a fearsome reputation, and guests could have been forgiven a shiver of fear when she turned up at a Halloween party in New York right, Wendy, 48, wore a Day of the Dead hairdress with gold skulls, while her boyfriend, hunky Hungarian model Bertold Zahoran, 22, had his face painted like a skeleton. Wendy in set with Bertold is known to appreciate the male form. She once allegedly gushed of Tony Blair he has such a good body and, really, really good legs. Eccentric singer Paloma Faith has a child with French artist Lehman Larchini, but she doesn't seem to think his largely grotesque works will bring in much dough. I'm in a relationship where I'm the breadwinner, she tells me. It puts more pressure on my new album to be a success. A former coach on BBC show The Voice, Paloma, 36, has never disclosed their baby's name or, she adds I did The Voice because I knew I was going to have a child. I needed to get some money in the bank before I stopped working.